Hi everyone, my name is Nia, and this is a game like the other one that I played, where we press the button, that I also found a lot of people playing recently, and another one that made me kind of interested. And this one is Would You Rather. It's basically kind of the same thing, just a little bit different. But, uh, let's give it a go. Okay, so, it's pretty self-explanatory anyways. Would you rather be, or would you rather be in the Justice League or be an Avenger? To be honest, I'm not really a huge um, Marvel DC superhero fan for reasons, and um, I'm not going to get into those reasons because they're I don't, they're personal, but they're not so personal that they they make a difference. It's just I don't want to bore you guys with it. But long story short, I'm not really a big um, DC Marvel fan anymore. Like I used to like X Men and a few other things, but other than that, I'm not really into it much anymore, for, again, reasons. So, I guess it doesn't matter. Um, between the two, I guess, uh, I'm, I think, Aven I'm going to assume Avengers are Marvel? So, would Justice League be uh, DC? I don't know. I'm not sure. So, I guess I'll just go with Justice League, because I used to watch things for Justice League. Um... And see people disagree with me because I don't I don't really know which one would be better, I guess. So forgive me. Okay. Would you rather sing everything you say or dance all of your movements? Um <laughs> I I'm actually not against either one of these. The thing with this is uh I don't mind singing everything I say. And I don't mind dancing all my movements, because I use a lot of hand gestures anyways. Um, however, dancing after a while gets very tiring, and it becomes kind of hard to do it. And if you were to do it for every single thing that you did, that would get very tiring. Like, I, I don't think I'd be able to do that. So I'll sing everything I say. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Okay. Would you rather be stalked by Slenderman or be take part in one of Jigsaw's games? I'm okay. This is weird for me to say considering I've been playing more horror things lately. I granted their RPG maker games, but um I did try lurking and that didn't turn out well for me, so I not uploading it because it just it it was better off with me just scrapping it. But, uh, I actually don't really like a lot of horror things in, in terms of, um, like, movies. Because this is, long story short, they're always, you can always guess what's going to happen even at the beginning of the movies. And they're all so cliche and overdone and it's just, it's not interesting to me. Like, I sit there I will literally, if I have to watch a horror movie I will literally sit there and make fun of the movie that entire time while everyone else is scared of it and they will get mad at me for making fun of it. And that's just, I don't know. Like, horror games are different because horror games, you're actually playing them. You're actually in doing the experience itself. So I honestly don't know what Jigsaw's from. I don't know what the games are. Um, but to be stalked by Slenderman does not seem like fun either. Um, so what do I do? I don't know. Like, is Jigsaw's games better than Slenderman? I don't know. Oh, sh like, I, 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 I don't know. So, I guess I'll just go with Slenderman because that's all I'm familiar with. Although I probably wouldn't want that. So, we'll find out. Oh, okay. So, apparently, Jigsaw's games are pretty bad. Um, because 70% agreed with me. If you were trapped in a cage, would you rather be trapped with a tamed lion, or a tamed tiger, or be trapped with a rabid, squ uh, rabid squirrel? Well, okay. If I had to be trapped in the cage with either one of them, um, a rabid squirrel would be scary as crap. 
which doesn't seem scary, but rabid eh, is the word here. Or be trapped with a tamed lion. Lions can be scary, especially if you're in, trapped in a cage with them. But the thing with that is, it says tamed dra er, dragon. I'm sorry. Tamed tiger. So my assumptions are is that tiger will be safer to be in than a rabbit squirrel. Uh, don't question me. I don't know. Hey, cool. I am not the only one. That's cool. Okay. Would you oh would you rather vote for Barack Obama or vote for Mitt Romney? Again, me you can learn more about me. I'm a terrible person and I'm not registered to vote and I don't care about politics. I know. A lot of people tell me, well, you should vote. You should do this. You, it makes a difference. You should be American and I'm just sitting there like, I'm sorry. I've never been interested in politics. I I'm not gonna lie about that. And I'm not registered to vote because, because of that reason, yes, voting for the president is important. I will not deny that. However, I don't know which person stands for what. So I can't vote on someone that I don't know what they stand for. And as far as I know, Mitt Romney was pretty awful. But I see a lot of people out there have things against Obama. So I don't know. He's a terrible president. I see that a lot. Terrible American right here. I don't pay attention to that stuff. So I guess I'll just go for Obama because I've heard a lot of bad things about Mitt Romney. Okay, cool. So I'll... I love... <coughs> Some of these I'm just guessing. Would you rather... Or, oh, if you were stuck in the woods, would you rather have a tomahawk or have a knife? Um, I don't know. If I was stuck in the woods... Does this go with Slender Man following me? I wonder. <laughs> uh, okay. So, I'm not too uh, up on, I don't, or with weapons. But, uh, a tomahawk is kind of like a uh, an axe of sorts, correct? I don't know. I think so. Um,. And if I were stuck in the woods, I would think that would be more useful for cutting down trees and making a place to stay in and stuff like that. So, um, the knife would be handy too, but I think I will go with the tomahawk. Okay. Would you rather run 26 miles or swim 5 miles? Oh, gosh, you get to know so much about me and how stupid I am. I don't know distance that well. Like, I've, uh, whenever it came to how many inches in so and so and so and so, I never knew for sure off the top of my head because it's, I, like, me as a person, I tend to have a lot of, um, things that I kind of just, I don't think about that I should think about. Like, I've had friends be like, well, what blood type are you? I don't know, I don't ask. I, I mean, it's probably something good to know about, but I don't think about that stuff. Um, distance, direction, stuff like that, that should be known. And I'm sorry that I don't. Um, I don't really know it that well. So, I honestly, uh, between the two of these, um, running 26 miles seems like a long time. And I'd get tired, but to swim five miles seems like a long distance. And maybe not as long as running, but there's always... I'm not the best swimmer. I'm so-so. I'm, I'm, I'm okay, but I wouldn't say I'm amazing at swimming. I know enough, is the thing. Um, I honestly don't think I'd be able to swim long distances. So, would I rather be tired out of my mind for this amount of miles for running? Or possibly drown because I can't swim any further. I'll think I'll take running. Okay. Well, again, I... Whatever. Oh, gosh. Would you rather be a Montague? Montague? I'm sorry if I say that wrong. Or a Capulet? Uh, I know what this is from, obviously. Romeo and Juliet. But I don't... 
I haven't actually read that story in a, a long time. I don't really follow Romeo and Juliet very much. So, I honestly... I don't really have a preference, I guess. Um, I guess I'll just go Capulet because Juliet. Okay, I honestly don't know. I'm sorry. Um, would you rather have no eyebrows or have a unibrow? Well, I'd like to have eyebrows. But does that mean I can have a unibrow and just pluck it? That's what I'm going to take out of this because nothing says that I can't do that. Um, I'll just do this. I'll just pluck my eyebrows. <laughs> Would you rather star in a cartoon movie or star in a live action movie? Okay. Cartoon movies would be really fun to do. Voice acting. However, to star in a live action movie would be so much fun. Oh my god, I would love that. Yes. I've always been interested in voice acting or trying to. Would you rather have an- Oh, this is an easy one for me. Would you rather have a iPhone or have an Android device? I have an Android here, which is taking my time right now. And I, I really don't like Apple things. I hate Apple. I'm sorry for the people who out there who love Apple, but I hate Apple. The only thing I would get for an Apple from Apple willingly is an iPod, and that's it. Because I have such a big rant about iPhones. They break so easily, and you can do like most of the stuff that you can on an iPhone, on an iPod with the um, right apps, because they do have apps for calling and texting on phones. They have FaceTime on my iPod that I have right now. FaceTime. So, I mean, granted you need a Wi-Fi connection, but I'll take an Android. I'm not gonna go on this because I have this huge rant about iPod or Apple, and apparently a lot of people disagree. Not a lot of people, but people disagree with me. But I don't like Apple. I don't. I'm sorry. I don't. Okay. Um, would you rather get four hours of sleep per night or get 15 hours of sleep per night? I love sleep, and. If I could sleep forever, well, not forever, ever, I mean, like, if you slept forever, you'd be dead. Or in a coma. Either way. But, 15 hours is a lot. Uh, will I say I've never had that amount of sleep in a day? No, I can't say that, because I'm pretty sure I have. Um, and I don't get enough of it, so I, I guess, I mean, I'm used to this, the four hours of sleep per night, but... I'd rather sleep if I can. <laughs> so I, I, I'm gonna be that person and sleep. Yes, good. Okay. Would you rather have a huge head and a small neck or have a huge neck and a small head? Okay, so the thing with this is, um, I guess I don't really care about neck, head size or whatever. But I think of this in a more of a medical way. If I have a small head, which would probably suck, I don't know. Maybe not as smart because brain not as big, whatever, you know. I don't know. But, uh, in a huge neck, I wouldn't like the huge neck. But the way I feel is if I didn't, if I had a small neck, like just this teeny little neck, there'd be nothing holding up that head to begin with, especially if it's a huge head. So, um,. You know, if I were to have a huge head and a small neck, my body, my head would not stay on my ne my neck and it would just snap off. I This is my thoughts anyways. I don't know if that's correct or not. Okay, well, maybe I'm just weird. That's very possible. Would you rather have all of um, Disney World to yourself for one day or spend the day at the Playboy Mansion? Um... I'm childish, and I love Disney. I like, I really love Disney movies. I do. And the music, and all that. So, I don't care about Playboy Mansion. I'm female. Part of it. So, definitely, Disney World. I've always, I've never been able to go to Disney World or Disneyland, and it makes me sad. And one day I will. Because I love Disney. Talk, or would you rather talk in an all-tuned voice, 
or talk in the stereotypical grandma voice. Oh gosh. Um, an auto-tuned voice would be kind of uh, kind of amusing to be completely honest. <laughs> I wouldn't want to talk in the stereotypical grandma voice. That seems like a bad thing, so I'm going to go with auto-tuned. Have a little pep in my speech. Would you rather go to prison for five years or get punched hard in the face every hour, every day for five years? Wow, okay, that's... Uh, I wouldn't like to be punched in the face every single day, every hour. But I wouldn't want to go to prison for five years either. But, you know, I'm going to leave this to you guys because I'm out of time again. So you can do what or put down in the description down below um, what you would got you guys would do you guys right there yeah all of you all of you put down what you would do in the description down below I'm interested in seeing what you would do um, obviously you know my answer I'd probably go to prison because I really don't want to get punched in the face every day every hour um, but <laughs> but let let me see what you guys would do so. If you want to play this game, or whatever you'd call this, this one, um, unlike the other, is not uh, the same name as the site or the you know the game itself. This is um, you could probably like I actually googled this to find where it was, um, and it came up right away, so it was fairly easy to find it. But uh, if you guys are interested, the link will be down in the description down below. And, um, I think it's either.io, and that's, I think that's it, just what it is. But, uh, yeah, it will be down in the description down below. Otherwise, you can Google it. It's pretty simple to find it. Um, there will be other games down in the description down below as well. It was the link to this game, um, that I've played in the past. they are just kind of just random out the wall games. But, um, I'll see, or if you like this, so like, so subscribe, but I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.